Welcome to my channel, Steve of the Window Cleaner. Today, I just want to talk about a simple little tool that you should really get if you are an avid water-fed pole user and you find that the connection that goes from your system to your 516th hose or your hose coming off your system to your 516th hose is always breaking on you and you're getting sick of it. So, Zero has come out with something very, very nice. Um, most likely, if you have ever gotten one of these in the past, you probably remember getting it with this little piece here, okay? This little piece here goes into it just like that. And then you basically have your water-fed pole hose from your water-fed pole and it plugs into that. And that's how you get the water out to your water-fed pole because you have a lighter hose. And in Zero poles, we have the 516 Zero hose. Okay, that's a push to fit. So usually you would push it on the rim and pull on the hose. What happens a lot is people in a haste or employees will just rip it out without engaging this. And then this orange rim will pop out. After a while, they can look a little bit more like this and get pretty damaged, okay? So, as Zero has done is created a new piece that is this, all right? This has a little 516 push to fit. So now, if you ever have just this piece break, right? This piece snaps, all you have to do is replace this piece instead of replacing a whole entire one of these. So then, the nice thing about that, of course, is it's easy to replace. And so you would just, you have this on here, same thing. This goes into there, and then this goes to your water fed pool. So that's the whole entire connection. Now, one other kind of cool thing that this opens up the door for is something else. Is a connection to run two water fed poles if you really want to. So what I have behind me is the Unger Hydropower, and I'm just gonna show you what I do to use this to hook up two water fed poles. For some reason, everyone's really obsessed with hooking up two water fed poles, understandable. You wanna make sure you have high flow. Uh, one thing that's interesting about the Unger Hydropower is what I found is that it looks really like low amount out of the actual system without a hose plugged in. As soon as you plug a, a hose into it, it kind of builds up some pressure. I know it's always a way higher pressure. Maybe you notice that too. So what we're gonna do for that is I'm just gonna use one of these. So a little pie push to fit. So this really opens the door for a lot of cool things. So we'll put that on here, okay? Then I got this running here. So this, do this one handed. We'll go right into that. So now you have two holes. I don't think this is much anything new, but I kind of just want to show you guys it. So I got just two water fed poles set up over there. Something to think about too, when you look at the water fed, when you look at the uh, flow coming from these two poles that have tested this, is that it could reduce as you elevate the poles into the air. So you would want to get a high flow system for sure. You don't really want to use a pump with DI only because it can move through too fast and not purify. But this is just to show you a way to do it off of really any system if you had high flow. So boom, we're going to the poles. This only has about, this yellow neon has, I would say 100, or no, about 40 feet of hose. And this orange one is 100 feet of hose. So to show you the flow from both of these. So, I mean, you could totally make that work. I mean, totally, more than enough. And this one, got four pencil jets running. A little bit of pressure there. So, just some things to think about with that new connection. I'll put a link to that in the comments and in the description of this video. But a very helpful, just little tool that kind of uh, makes it less costly if these things break and then you just put a new one of these. You can get sets of five for these for super low on our website as well. So I'll put links to these, I'll put links to the Y push to fit and I'll also put links to um, that new set we have for the 516 connection for your on off valve as well. Alrighty guys, that's it. But I just want to show you that because I think it would be a valuable tool for you to add to your water fed pole tool arsenal. Have a good day. Bye.